What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, John for the Game Dude here. Welcome you back to another episode of The Saga Lock. Hopefully, y'all are having a wonderful, fantastic day as I am. Honestly, this is going to be one of those kind of interesting kind of territory type episodes because I honestly have no idea what's going to go on or how this is going to go. Uh, if it's going to go good, if it's going to go bad. I just, I genuinely don't know. So, today we have a, a couple things. We have a professor fight. We have a French Bridge situation. Like, it's going to be a longer episode. Uh, so, sit back, relax, which something that I won't be able to do. Um, <laughs> get prepared for the chaos that is going to be ensuing because, honestly, this episode is going to be just chaotic by, na chaotic by nature. And so, I do hope that you guys are excited about it. Because, yeah, like I so. said, I'm excited for the chaos, but I'm also scared for the chaos. Um, reasonably so. So, um, let's go ahead and get this show on the road. We have our team trained up, I believe. Let me double check that. Stat, fact. Yes. And we have our new party member. Nobody else changed, obviously. We have Wesley with overcoat. So, we are protected by the things such as hail, powders, um, sand, stuff like that. So, that's not bad. Um, powder moves will not work, so sleep powder, poison powder, they do not have to worry about them, so that's not bad. And, yeah, I really honestly think we should get the show on the road. I'm going to put Troy out of the front of the party, though, and put Bollywood there. I think Bollywood feels like a decent need on our team right now. So, let's get this going. I think that, honestly... Um, I might have to turn off the experience share at some point during today's episode. I'm not 100% sure about that fact, though. So, hello, hello. Uh, my dear Shady, I apologize to, to you. I have to apologize to you about Shy Swall. I'm very sorry for the, the couple of trouble he caused, but I'd also like to thank you. I'm sincerely sincerely grateful what you did for all of the Pokemon and people in this world. By stopping the Bright Shadow, you also saved Shy Swall himself. I also knew that he desired a beautiful world. And maybe someday the population of people in Pokemon will actually increase to a point where resources become very scarce. <laughs> if someone acts out of greed in such a world, surely some will go without. If all living things keep acting that way, there will be nothing left at all in the end. Why there won't be anything left to steal, will there? What I really wanted was for him to put his ego aside and lead everything to greater heights. I never had the discussion with him, though. So... I'm practically, re I'm partially responsible for this. Well, enough of that, Shady. I want to know your progress and everything you've learned on your journey so far. Hit me with your best shot. Yeah, Professor, I kind of don't want to do this because my team is scary in a scary spot. We had to add a new Pokemon because something died and we've had the most deaths since the Saga Lock. Um, and this is why we don't want to fight you, because of course you have a legendary to start out with. It's a great job. Luckily, we love with Bollywood, though, so we made a good decision. Because honestly, here's the weird thing Bollywood's kind of becoming a very interesting member of the party. One of those members that you're like, oh, they're going to do nothing. They're, you're fine. It's okay. And then you realize, wait a minute, Bollywood's going to become essential at some point if things keep dying the way that they are. Like, not that Bollywood's not essential right now. We do, like I said, we love and appreciate him, but like. There's a, a new height. Uh, you have a quick claw. To... That is not a quick claw, good sir. That is a uh, grass gem. <laughs> grass gem leaf storm. Getting everything out of that first leaf storm, honestly. Probably the strategy. That was actually a pretty good strategy. I like. I don't have anything to say there. That was <laughs> that was actually pretty good. Um, Volcarona is next. Wow. Okay, you're hitting me with another bug. Um, I'm gonna send in magic though. Magic can deal with this. Uh, magic, just aqua tail it away to say uh, we cannot, we cannot mega. That is the thing about um, magic is like I'm allowed. Oh, I can diamond storm actually. That might be better. Yeah, that's better. It's I don't care it's stab, but it's qu the quad. It's the quad weakness of this is gonna make this better. So, but what I could die here. It does die here. Perfect. We love that. We stand that. We want that to happen. Can, sorry, Volcarona, but your your purpose in life is to die. Uh, <laughs> what a great purpose, isn't it? Ooh, let me adjust that to 6. That's triggering me that it's at 5.96. I turned it down a little bit. Okay, I guess this one... Wait, can I can I do it from here? No, you can't. That's so dumb. I kind of wish there was a functionality in OBS where you could, like, click on it and that would make it change, right? 
because yeah, six and three. We'll I'll take that. Amoga. Swapping out of that. That sounds dangerous. It's a uh, fly. It's part flying. So I'm actually gonna go ahead and send in Wesley for Wesley's debut fight. That seems like a, the best course of action. Um, but yeah, so I, I do wish that OBS you could just type in the decibel that you wanted, not have to drag the scale, because the scale can kind of get annoying, and having to manage the scale is just like, ugh. That that phrasing is great. Bull strike. Actually, you know what? You can hit me with that all all you want to. That shouldn't do too much. Okay, well don't hit me with that all the all you want to. Because if you wanted to do it, if you did all you wanted to, I would die. But it's not too big of a threat, so that's good. Wesley, good job. Agron. Agron, that's the kind of Pokemon I don't want to be facing. Gosh dang it, Agron. I just literally would talk about how amazing you were and that we love you. Because in fantasy football, he's officially knocked out of the playoffs. He can't make it to the playoffs. And he's not the only one. There's another one that's officially knocked out and can't make it to the playoffs. So two people are knocked out. I'm in. I'm locked in. Of the, well, I said that already before. But I'm even further locked in. Is now I'm in position two. Um, which is great, you know. And if Joy would have listened and started a kicker, I would have a chance at first. But that's fine. It, it's okay. I, I, it's okay. It's fine. You know, <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna mess with you like about that forever. Just so you know, like not forever, forever, but still, it's gonna be a running gag. I'm sorry, um, Agron. Why do I feel like Cho or Troy is actually my best option on this? Troy has the fighting move. Oh. I hate this, but I think it's the choice. Because, I mean, yeah, I'm like, Bollywood can't do a thing. Wesley will die. Magic probably will die. Everything on my team except for Satan has a weakness to this. But Satan cannot touch this. Because all of Satan's moves are... Oh. Resisted. Right? Diamond Storm can't touch that. Psycho Cut can't touch that. Shadow Ball can't touch that. And Dragon can't. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's right. the option. I mean, I think actually in this generation they changed it so I could have hit it with Shadow Ball. Actually, now that I think about it. But even then, it's not at. This is a better risk, right? Because I would rather risk the fact that Troy can kill with a quad effective move. Um. Which he did not. Troy really should have just died right there. But you know what? I'll take it. I'm going to foul play it. That's 100% accurate, actually. Wow, Troy really should have just died right there. Uh, just Troy escaping death one one time and uh, time, time again. Um, Hariyama. That is going to be the Satan switch. That is the Satan switch right there because that ooh okay, but head smash. Here's the thing though about head smash, is head smash probably would have killed Garatina, like no doubt about it. 150 base power stab, that probably actually yeah that totally would have killed. I mean so again it goes along my point of this is probably the safer bet, but oh boy. See, uh, I can't trust Satan. Like, you're only... You are 10 levels above and only doing half damage, good sir. Like... I completely understand that that is a Hariyama on my screen. Like, I'm not saying that... Oh, my God. Oh. Breloom's dead. Who is... Who did I forget? On the layout. Breloom doesn't exist. Oh my god, I forgot magic on the left. <laughs> wow. I don't even know what's coming out anymore. I'm gonna send in magic. I legit... I was like, Braylon is not on the team anymore. Because I deleted slacking off the party thing. Because so many deaths have happened since I had... Oh, it was a crest. Okay. I mean... I can Mega, actually, on this, and then Aqua Tail. 
Poor Magic. Doesn't deserve that. Um, I'm sorry, buddy. Um... But that means you're... That, that, I was like, okay. It felt odd, right? It, and it felt wrong having Swalot in spot 4 or spot 5. But I couldn't quite figure out why. Yeah, that's, that would be why. Uh, poor Magic didn't make the layout party, apparently. He didn't get his photo taken, you know. It's, it's fine. He, he was a little late to that. Um, or she was a little late to that. She was trying to make herself look beautiful and be fine and, you know. And then forgot. Just that's what happens, you know. She forgot to make it to Victor Day. Uh, and apparently so did Spoopy, because if that was the case, Spoopy would have been on the layout. Um, but yeah, it's fine. Uh, Troy is level 68. So Troy is at level cap. Terry is level 66. And that's kind of my problem. I don't know what I want to do with that. Because we have Friendship Bridge. I mean, necessarily, pretty much, Friendship Bridge is what's left, right? That is the final kind of situation here. So the question arguably becomes, I mean, we've been struggling with the way that this situation is. Honestly, I don't know. I'm debating pointlessness because if we're struggling with the way it is now, why shrink the gap? Eh, that's, that's a good question. If you're struggling now, why shrink the gap and make it things worse on yourself? Like, <clears throat> that just seems like a dumb idea in practice, so... And now we don't have a... We do not have... The... A, a surfer. So our core way town encounter is going to end up... Being... A... Oh, we can't fish. That's pseudo sort of dumb. Why, why can't we fish? This is literally... What? Shalor stable. Okay, but again, the, the answer is still, why can't we fish? Where's the fishing dock? There's got to be a dock to fish. What? Can you not get encounters in Corway Down? I swore you could. What? I mean, I guess I didn't look to see if I could, but I just kind of assume. Oh, yeah, I kind of assumed. This is just for pure aesthetic? Wow. That's stupid. I mean, it's not really. It's, it's a really beautiful area, but that's dumb that it's for aesthetic only. Okay. Route 19. The Friendship Bridge Route. And I'm going to tread very lightly on this route. Do, 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 do. I think this is... Oh. Never mind. Um, yeah, but I'm going to tread lightly because I do not want to run into things... That I don't want to, like, trainers. Because, here, again, here's that, that that logic, that thinking. Oh, that's Friendship Bridge right there. Okay, we're cool. Well, we'll get our encounter on Route 19, then. You know what? I'll take that. That is not bad. Needle Armit. Why not? See how much damage that this non-stab Needle Armit... Yeah, look at that. Nothing. Oh, we don't have a normal type to just switch in on this anymore. Okay, well, yeah, that's still a typing that I want, so I don't care about taking damage here. Ah, uh, we. Oh, wait. I was like, oh, we didn't take damage. Cool. No, we are going to. I probably should not have risked the poisoning on that, but. It's okay. Pointlessly use clear smog, get hit with the phantom force again, and then hit hit it with a cross poison because it doesn't matter. The cross poison does not matter if it like hits or not, so or crits or not. So, shadow claw. Speaking of moves that can crit, um, I I can't risk the crit. It's Bollywood. Yeah, I cannot risk this crit. It's Bollywood. I like Bollywood. <laughs> Bollywood's good. Okay, 
now let's go ahead and hit you with the uh, Ultra Ball, or hit you, throw an Ultra Ball at you, and then get Friendship Bridge going. Rock, we gotta rock Friendship Bridge. I think we can do it. Oh, thank you, Dustin. Why are you just, you literally let us do it. Cool. I'm gonna name it SDS because SDS totally thought that, like, Dusk Noir was better than uh, Dusk Lops, and so we're naming it SDS. That's, that's just how that works. Uh, if SDS wants it so bad, it can be he can be named after it. That that that's what. It <laughs> uh, I'm mean sometimes, but it's the truth. If you want it so bad, you can be named after it. Like, I get that Dusknoir has its benefits, but competitively, come on. There's... I know you really wanted it for, like, a Poke or Pokedex collection, but, like... Ah, uh, it triggered me a lot. And it shouldn't. I'll be one hundred percent. I'll be the first to admit it. it. should not have triggered me that much. But I was like, Dusclops is better for a run. You don't really need Dusclops. It's, it's fine. But I want it for the deck. Or the Pokedex. Okay. I mean... Yeah, you, you do you. Like, and I know the Pokedex is a big thing in Pokemon. Hi, Mega! Hey, do you know what is about to happen? Of course I do. We're about to have a Pokemon battle. Oh my god, I was right. I can't believe that Charizard's about to try and whack me to no end. Charizard! Do we have to have a moment? Can we, can, can we talk about this real quick? Your first Mon that you let off with was a Zekrom, excuse me. A drop of Draco Zekrom. I'm looking at you right now. Really? I know you have a Mega Charizard X. Which is fine and all, but... You're really about to try to overpower me with this kind of stuff. I see you. Don't think it out. Free shock. That's a 140 base power ice move. Jeez, Louise, Charizard. That's also physical, I think, as well, which is, like, great. But, I mean, I guess this is kind of perfect opportunity to send in Wesley and let Wesley figure out what he wants to do in life because he's going to have to figure that out now. He's got the help of a uh, freaking, uh, what? I was going to say Swallow. That's not his name. He's got the help of Bollywood, so maybe he'll figure it out. Draco, that's going to be more powerful, or it's pretty powerful, but. Do you know what would have been actually crazy right there in my head? I just thought up of a stupid situation where Zekrom had Contrary and... It would have boosted up his... I saw the word boosted. I freaked out. It would have boosted his uh, special attack back to normal. And I would have been like, oh my god. But like... Because then Turbo Blaze freaking would have came in completely handy. Barbarical. You know, I was about to say, let me go switch into KD real quick. Because I'm looking at the freaking layout. We don't have KD. Um, <laughs> god. I, <laughs> that's how much I miss KD. My, my initial gut reaction was, let me go into KD real quick. Oh. Anyways, um, Barbarical. What do we go into for a Barbarical, actually? That's a really good question. I'm thinking Terry. Oh, that made me so sad for a second. I was like, let me go into this. Oh, no, you don't have that. That doesn't exist. And now you're looking at the layout because, you know, you look at the camera and the game's there and the layout's here and, like, everything's right here, which is why it's a priority to make the layout right. But, you know, it's fine. It's fine. It's okay. It's it's, it's all chill. It's all fine at any. I'm definitely not freaking out. Uh... Dynam Excuse me, Charizard. Charizard, you stop with this stuff, please. I do not need to be frantically thinking about death over five seconds. Can you help me out with that? Apparently not, but like, you know, you know, I would like you to help me out with that. Chandelure. Chandelure is kind of a new Pokemon. Like, for me right now. Magic's the best case scenario for it, but... Ugh. Download. 
It's attack rose. That's fine, actually. That's perfectly fine. I'm gonna aqua tail it. Stab, super effective, should kill. Yes, it did. Cool. Aerodactyl. It's another problem, child. That's scary that rock's kind of the problem. Actually, have an idea. Uh, it's a mega aerodactyl, so this idea could very well be terrible, but. I'm getting rid of my flying typing, which makes rock. That furthers the issue of rock. Oh my god. If I would not have mega, we would have just died there. Because, of course, you know, he just had Rock Cracker out, out the gate just with no problem at all. Flareon, we stay in. And last but not least, you'll have your Charizard. I'm actually super proud that he saved his Mega Charizard for last. Um, because he's supposed to have a Mega Charizard, and if he doesn't have a Mega Charizard, that's going to be very, 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 very weird. Considering everybody else has their main team. Apparently, he doesn't have a Charizard. Whatever. It's fine. Um, odd. I mean, to be fair, though, if I'm going to be 100% honest, I just stay in and start clicking rock, rock, uh, the rock move that I have. So, realistically, that doesn't make too much of a difference. Um, but I just feel bad, like, as far as person-wise goes, because Charizard deserves to have his mascot if everybody else has it, but... Whatever. It's, it's, it's just a thing, I guess. Um, but yeah, Charizard, really exciting battle, but unfortunately not the, the, that, that did scare me. Hey, S Meister. Hey, Mega. How are you? Hi, Jonas. Hi, Tierno. Nothing big. How about you guys? Why, the same as you, Mega. We heard about S Meister. We heard from, about S Meister from the Professor. We came running fast as we could. S-Meister, can we have a Pokemon battle? Oh, sorry to just throw this on you, but you're gonna do this without healing or doing anything. Okay, Carp. You know, just let, let, let Charizard do the work and then throw out your Kabalion of all things. Because, of course, you want to throw out a Legendary immediately. What's with the, what's with my re like rivals throwing out Legendaries instantaneously? I don't know. But we didn't get healing, so that's great. Um, and we have a Kabalion to face now, so that's also great. Um, hmm. Fighting and... Or steel and fighting is not the type combination to be fighting. Especially without a ground type. Troy is probably the best option. Troy is kind of coming clutch in a lot of ways. That's why he's the highest level. But... I thought that was going to do more, honestly. But you're a steel and fighting type. Why the frick do you have a ground move? Didn't you? Didn't your mom tell you you're not allowed to have a ground move? You're only allowed to have your stab? Apparently not. Because that's why I use Sacred Fire and not any of my other moves. No, that's not, how, that's not how it works. I wish it was how it worked. That would make things easier. But nope, that's not how it works at all. Um, hmm. Magic's growing to level 65. Lunatone. Well, I guess we have to send in magic. That's that's the answer to this question. It's a Lunatone. The problem with the Lunatone is we have to make Evolve and hit first. We can't just leave ourselves in and subject ourselves to death. So... We gotta heal on the subsequent turn. Which could go awful, but... That's fine. Okay. Raikou. Well, about switching on the or uh, healing on the subsequent turn, uh, that that won't be happening anymore. Satan, get out of here. <sighs> the good positive thing is we know Raikou does not have anything but uh, electric moves, so we know that we're safe against this Raikou. Like, and we're in complete and utter safeness rather than. I don't know if we're going to be safe or not because of the typing. Because Raikou followed the rules. 
Why does your Raikou have Thunder and not mine? Excuse me? Excuse me? Carp, are you cheating? Or did my butt to turn on the set moves to be higher power and that's why I'm struggling? Is that I fudged a setting up? Huh. What? Unless I denied Thunder, which... But I feel like I would not have denied Thunder. Like, regardless of the accuracy, I probably would have gotten rid of... Or had charge over Thunder. And, I mean, Rock Blast over Thunder, to be honest, too. Wesley. It is a Dredagon, so we'll see. Dreadagon's gonna probably hit me with a, um, a physical, uh, or, like, outrage or something right here, though, so. I don't know, that just seemed odd. Are you kidding me? I look away for one second and we get hit with a freaking heat crash. Really? Are you kidding? Wow. Um. Well, shoot, Nougats. I've got to send him Bollywood. Oh, it wasn't heat crash. It looked like heat crash, but it was not. Well, there's that rage I was talking about. At least I knew that he was going to have it, but that's not good for us. That's going to be... That, that that puts him in very dangerous range, as that did 100 damage. I got to stay in. It did 109. Nice. I was going to say, I needed to get that... I needed to get that poison for this to work out the way I needed it to. Okay, poison plus confusion. Let's go ahead and use our super potions or our hyper potions, which are starting to become not enough, which is scary. Because I don't want to have to buy the the max potions, really, if I don't have to, but Nice, we got the hit. And I'll take this opportunity. Because poison should kill to heal up Wesley. Like, let's be honest. Poison should kill this thing. Especially when it does that. Cool. I mean, we didn't need that, but I'll take it. Zeb Strika is one of the final mons. I've got to go. I got to go with Wesley. I think Wesley is a good Pokemon that just needs to be utilized a little bit better. We have, we don't have much utilization for Wesley. But I, I, I kind of want to rely a little bit more on Wesley because Wesley is a good one. Nice. This is why I want to. That's why I want to rely on Wesley. Like, he's a good mon. Unless he gets thought out instantly and just uses Zap Cannon and does his thing. But yeah, but that's also a problem if I accidentally misclick the setting. If I did or not. I don't I don't know. But like Zap Cannon is kind of a bad move and they're just using it a lot. And I uh, I really hope that's not what I did. Cause like I always make sure to check that setting off because I don't like that setting. I feel like that setting's kind of meaningless. Magic. 
Like, it's it's hyped up to be something better than it is. Ugh. And it's literally the whole point of the use level up only. Unless it's using... If I do it... No, because I would have recognized that if it was using the level up only. And I wouldn't be struggling as much as I did if he used level up only, because freaking Rotom can't learn Blue Flare. So, yeah. So I definitely didn't do that. I am not... I, I'm not... I, I think I'm stressing and worrying about something that had, doesn't even exist and has no... I have no reason to worry. But as an Nova Warrior, um, that's definitely not something I'm um, opposed to being worried about, so... Great Pokemon trainers like us have marked blah, 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 blah. Let me heal your Pokemon before I battle you. I'll join the crowd and we can have a Pokemon battle. Okay, Jonas, let's do it. Your character is... Not... Oh, you led with a Marowak. Because of course you did. Something that counteracts my lead. Because, you know, I don't have the opportunity to lead switch, but you did. Um, Well, magic get out here. But here's the fun part, is that it's Encounters and Gym next episode. And so with it being Encounters plus Gym next episode, that's going to make next episode very, very intriguing. For many reasons. Caracosa. Bollywood. I don't know why I didn't send you out against the uh, Barbarical. I really should have, and then I realized, oh, huh, this is a thing that I can do. Um, I know I'm probably going to get hit with a very high power rock move after, because I this is not going to kill. Oh, never mind. We won't, because we flinched. I forgot, Needle Arm has like a 30% chance to flinch or something silly like that. 20 or 30% chance, so it's actually one of those like weird good moves that it's very undervalued and underrated. Honestly, I would love to make... That is a video that I might want to make at some point. Victimi! Yeah, that's a swap. Victimi! Satan, Satan, you can take care of Victini, right? You should be able to. No, Satan won't be able to outco this. No way, right? You know, Satan... You just don't have the strength or the power to do anything in life anymore. Wow! Okay, I was joking. I was joking. First of all, first and foremost, I didn't think you were going to only do half. Excuse me? You have an extra stab, and you're not doing anything with it. You, that was literally 1.5 times 1.2. That was like, that's such a powerful move, and you just, nope, no to do anything. Reshiram. Jonas, Why? Why are you doing this? What is what is with you today? What has gotten into you? You're just deciding, I'm going to kill everything. Uh, it's fine. I'm just going to murder the crap out of everything in life. It's like, no, no, you probably shouldn't. But, you know, if you, I guess if it's your forte and you want to. Um, Diamond Storm is super effective, whereas Octel is not. So Diamond Storm is the better option here. R.O.T. Of course it's R.O.T. Why else would you? Well, what else would you do, right? You know? Just R.O.T. it. <sighs> Jeez. Th th like, this is actually maddeningly scary. Smeargle. Then you have a... Then you, then you just combat everything that I just said with just having a Smeargle. <laughs> because of course... Why the frick not? Why not? At this point, anything's possible. Uh. Well, we're sky uppercutting it. And then we exit Friendship Bridge, and we get to Snowbell. And then, like I said, it's that that area plus Jim. And then Victory. Yeah, jeez, we are so close. Critical. Well, sorry, we have your kind of perfect Pokemon here, and... Troy is going to just end Critical's career. Sorry, but it's happening. Bye, Critical.
There's still so much I don't know. I do not. I, do I have what it takes? Wow, I don't think I've ever heard you worry about being weak before, Jonas. You seem you seem to hold a lot you seem a lot bolder than you used to be. Is it that you went on your a journey? Or maybe it's thanks to what you've learned from being on your with your Pokemon and with us, your friends. I don't have any friends. No, you do. Um speaking of which, where the heck is Joy? She's off training with the Mega Evolution Guru. She said that friends are friends. Friends are friends, even if they can't be together. Honestly, Joy would say that. Joy has friends all over the world, okay? And she knows it, and it's fine. Indeed. Well, there will be something we must attend. Well, there's something we must attend to. Be seeing you. What do you have that you're attending to? Whatever it is, it must be very important. I'm glad I went on a journey. I made some great friends, and thanks to my little clickbait, I met... I, before we left, I was able to visit so many places, meet a lot of nice people, and make wonderful memories. S. Meister, this is from us. Have a waterfall. Thank you, Charizard. I appreciate you giving me waterfall. Um, honestly, you've helped a ton on this entire journey, so I do appreciate everything that you have done and making experiences a lot more fun and being able to be there to talk to and have a good time and just joke around bullshit BS and just hang out like it's been nice to talk this this I think that's what one thing that I've loved about this project is getting to think dink around and mess around with you a little bit more to be honest even if you're battling without the badge of Snowbell City Gym you can use Waterfall Gotta get going. Well, thank you. You gave me a thing I can use, so maybe I can actually go to the core marine city area. But, we gotta carry on. Continue on to Route 19. Do our job from there, and honestly... Oh. I saw that bottom, and I thought we were gonna have to traverse that. But I think that's actually Route 18, and that's... But yeah, so we made it to Snowball City Gym. Um, I am really debating on whether or not I should get my encounter... So that way we can kind of make that a little bit of an easier journey. Um, but I feel like we've kind of done a lot in this episode. Um, and I think even though there's a bunch of encounters and stuff going on that we have to we are yet to get. Um, realistically, it's enco two encounters. Maybe three, if I'm not too crazy. I think I saw the core four do something I didn't know about um, concerning these encounters. I actually went to go put something into the box. We don't actually need to, so that's cool. Um, but let's go ahead and look at our dust noir. Sturdy! Not bad. Um, I actually like that. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. Um, but yeah, we'll see you guys in the next episode. We'll get some encounters. We'll take on a scary, scary gym leader. And we'll see you guys then. Bye!